good morning students this is the second standard english chapter 6 that is the pinocchio and the egg the lesson name is pinocchio and the egg this lesson is related about that how you get hungry so how do you feel when you are hungry so how many of you will help your parents in the kitchen and what you have made by your own so this is related to the stories so when you get hungry what you'll do you'll go to the kitchen you'll make something whatever your favorite food we may be you just try to do that but actually it doesn't know how to make because so far your parents will do and give so here is a story about the boy called about a boy called pinocchio and how he is going to make an omelet egg omelet everything so it's very interesting story so let's we we'll go and enjoy the story So now let's begin this story that is the Pinocchio is alone at home and he is hungry. So what this Pinocchio is doing Pinocchio had an empty feeling in his stomach. He had eaten nothing that day. The empty feeling became hunger. The empty feeling means if if you won't eat anything uh if you won't have your breakfast if you won't have your lunch or whatever it may be then definitely you will get hungry isn't it general like that only the pinocchio pinocchio is also getting hungry because he has nothing eaten that day he has not eaten anything that day and he was alone at home and now see nobody is there to help him to give the food also now what this poor pinocchio will do now see the poor pinocchio ran, ran to the pot hanging over the fire in the fireplace see this is the pot where the something is hanging and here is the fire and see and he took the lid off lid means see how he is lifting the lid and he is just lifting the lid and he found nothing so the pot was empty and he was hungry as a bear he was very hungry so definitely when you get hungry you will also you will very isn't it like that only even this pinocchio also worried that now what nothing is there at home now how what i should eat so he is going to, he has, he has gone into the kitchen to make something and just when he gone to the kitchen he found something on the fire but when he lift the lid nothing was there so now see and he ran about the room and dug into all the boxes and drawers so he is searching is there anything to eat so if if something is if he gets means at least he can fulfill the Uh, his stomach so he is just wandering he looked for a piece of bread or a cookies or perhaps a bit of fish so whatever even you will also do like that only no children when you are very hungry you will just search for some biscuits or snacks or uh, biscuit packets or bread cookies whatever it may be and see he found nothing so all the drawers he checked all the boxes he checked but nothing was there he did not found anything and meanwhile his hunger grew and grew so when he got hungry what he is doing he is he is not he is not getting anything to eat to fill his stomach nothing he is going to get and meanwhile his hunger grew as grew grew and grew and means it's going to be and he became and he became dizzy and faint dizzy means he got tired and faint means is going to fall now because of hunger suddenly he saw something in the corner it was a round and white and it looked like a hen's egg so it was hen's egg only actually and see he pounced upon pounced means like that he he just catch and it was an egg so at least he thanks that something i got to eat and pinocchio was delighted delighted means he was very happy because he got something because he was very hungry so all the drawers he checked he searched in the kitchen for the bread cookies he did not get anything so now at least he got something to eat that is egg so he turned the egg over and over in his hand and kissed it and talked to it so even if you get something to eat what you'll do you'll just see and you'll just thanks isn't it so i got something to eat even this pinocchio is also thanks that he got something and he was delighted delighted means he was very happy and now how shall i cook you because he is very small he doesn't know how to cook because nobody is there at home to cook and give shall i make an omelet no it's it is better to fry you in a pan or shall i drink you so either we can make a omelet either we can fry but we cannot drink the egg isn't it children even do you drink the omelet i mean do you drink the egg no nobody will drink isn't it that is like a awkward so we just only make an omelet or else just we'll fry in a pan no the best way is to fry you in a pan definitely when you make an egg in the pan it gets a different taste and you will be taste better so he is going to do that only now he placed a little pan over the fire 
so now what we will do when we when we want to make